Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Um, I have a grocery haul, and it's from a few different places. I went to Kroger, Walmart, and Sam's Club. Um, the only things that aren't shown here is three cases of water from Sam's Club and two cases of the Kroger brand soda. Um, just because that's not a job for me. It's in my trunk. <laughs> Anyways, um, let's get started. Oh, and I got some things from Sprouts, too. But, yeah. We already, we got a meatloaf, but we already ate it. That was last night. Um, and then I just got this bag of potatoes right here. And it was $1.99. And I picked up this bag of potatoes today from Kroger. And I picked up this half and half. This is for a few recipes. Um, I also picked up some Italian style cheese blend. See all the different kinds of cheeses there. I picked up a box of these chewy dipped chocolate chip granola bars. If you can see, they've already been broken into a couple of these snacks. Um, like I said, it's a combined haul from yesterday and today. So, um, I also picked up a pack of what's well, a variety pack of um crackers with cheese and peanut butter and all different kinds um over here i got this for another couple recipes some chicken broth um i just got a few slices of american cheese um, i got a a what is this a half a pound of the boar boar's head sweet ham um, three things of sour cream. These are for recipes. A package of the spaghetti. Also a recipe. Picked up some mozzarella cheese. Some Italian style cheese. And I picked up the, well, my, the recipe that I'm doing it, uh, requires Parmesan. Which as you've seen before over here, I bought this one. But... I was going to buy some shredded parmesan, and it's so expensive. And for this Italian style, it has parmesan in it, but it also has all these other cheeses, and it was only like a dollar something. So, I got that. Picked up this Mexican style blend. Let's see. I got this for subs. It is hard salami, and it's a half a pound. And I got some pepperoni. I got this for subs as well. Or sandwiches. Chipotle chicken. Boar's head. Good. Some thin cut provolone. For sandwiches. I found these at Kroger on sale. They looked really good. Actually they sounded really good. But they looked really good too. They were $2.49. So I love finding stuff like this. Especially when it is all natural. And you can see it's grass-fed from milk from grass-fed cows i'm so sorry i can't talk today um and it's sharp cheddar cheese <coughs> excuse me oh my goodness Whew, i'm out of breath anyways yeah so i like finding prices like this that way i can try the product and in the future if i don't find a price like this and i like it then i will possibly buy it for full price um i bought a bag of baby carrots a four pound bag of broccoli florets, some salad, two lemons, two tomatoes, a thing of garlic bread, ah. a gallon of milk. I got some sub rolls here. These are from Sam's Club. We're going to make subs on Friday, so these will be good for that. A bag of Sesame hamburger buns. I seen a video um the needy home setter and she made some like fast food style um burgers so that's what we're gonna do is make some McDonald's type burgers at home because um I don't really like McDonald's. It's gross. But if you make the Mac sauce at home, it's so much better. Yeah. And here's some hot dog buns. <sighs> Here is some apple juice. I was craving pineapple, so I got some pineapple slices. And some more pineapple slices. 
I like it because the top is easy to open. Don't gotta get out the can opener. And can anybody explain to me why the fruit in the um, produce section that's already cut is so expensive? It's like seven dollars for a little thing of cut pineapple. That's ridiculous. And these are for my boyfriend. Some honey buns. Um, these were on sale as well. The jalapeno cheddar dip and the bean dip. I got some chopped onions. Again, for those fast food burgers. Um, if you want to check out her channel, I believe it's the Needy Homesteader. She has some really good stuff on there. Here's some Italian seasoning. Um, I found this. This is new. See, new. It's EVOO dressing. Caesar vinaigrette. So we'll see how this tastes. I'll let you know. If you want me to do a review on it, just comment below. Sorry guys, I have to keep pausing because my daughter is pressing like really seriously close to my lungs it feels like <sighs> and I can barely breathe. This whole entire pregnancy I feel like 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 I need an inhaler. It's just ridiculous. I got two boxes of the Kroger Man Wheat Thins. They call them Wheat Crisp but they're Wheat Thins. Um, I think a flower because again this was on sale. It's 99 cents this week at Kroger, or probably any Kroger store, um, if you get any three things. So I got this and two things of sugar, two things of Rice Krispie cereal. Um, now I'm here, this pile of chips. Okay. I know this looks very unhealthy and horrible, but I don't care. Um, they're on sale right now for a really good price, and... Mind you, I have two children, and I have a boyfriend who works every day and takes chips pretty much every day for his lunch. I don't let my kids take chips every day for their lunch, but these are a good stock up price, and, you know, they'll last for a long time. Um, you know, we have movie night, or my daughter has a birthday coming up, snacks at school, etc. It's just good for that, so I got Doritos. I got one of these cheddar and sour cream ruffles. Uh, there's some spicy Doritos in here somewhere. And then there's ranch Doritos in there somewhere. I got these for my boyfriend. Red velvet cream filled cakes. Um, if you see this on sale at your Kroger, I highly suggest you try it. Um, if you see this price right here, go ahead and grab one and try it. It is really good. It's like... The best orange juice. I don't know if you can see. That was a belly shot. <laughs> I don't know if you can see what it's called. It's my okay, there we go. Ah, come on. I believe it's Natalie's orange juice. And it's so good. The only thing that's in here is orange juice. Now, full price it's expensive, but for this price, get it. It's so stinking good. It's just oranges. It's delicious. Um, I think I showed these already. Granola bars and the crackers. Yeah. Anyways, guys. Um, that's everything. Oh, wait. No, it's not. Just kidding. Okay, don't judge me. My freezer is a mess. But I forgot I bought some freezer things as well. And I don't think I showed them. Um, yeah. So, I got a box of these. For my kids. The fun days, Sundays. Whatever Kroger brand ice cream cone things. I don't get that very often. Um, my boyfriend picked these up the other day from work. The Klondike um, Oreo ice cream sandwiches. These are so good. So, I highly recommend these if you have a, a craving for some Oreo ice cream sandwiches. They're very crunchy. Oh, I got a package of Tyson Fun Nuggets. Because it's that time of the year. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry about the noise. It's that time of the year and the kids are about to be out for a long break. So a lot of snacky stuff is coming into my house at the moment. I got some of this um, Extreme Moose Tracks ice cream. Oh, this is so good. This is so good, guys. If you see this and you're a chocolate lover, please try this. It is so delicious. Oh. It's so good, I wanted some for breakfast. I didn't eat it for breakfast, but I wanted some. I picked up this stuffed crust five meat pizza. It's the Sam's Choice pizza from 
with Walmart. Uh, I picked up a little Tony's, um, Totino's pizza for my kids. A package of ooh, breakfast sausage for this weekend. Ah, stuff is falling. Okay. Let me get it together here. I picked up these from my boyfriend's lunch, these chicken melts. And I don't know how they taste because I haven't tried it yet, but um, he took it today for the first time. So if you want to review on this, um, just let me know. I got him a box of these southern style chicken sandwiches. And again, I got him some Sam's Choice bacon double steak burger with cheese. And these are really good. Uh, sorry guys. One hand here. Okay. These are really good. These are the stuffed hash browns by Jimmy Dean's. These are from Sam's Club. Um, yeah, they're really convenient and easy for him to take to work and heat up real quick. But yeah, that's everything. Um, and I have a few like toiletry items that I picked up from uh, me and my daughter's trip um, over the holiday. I think I'm, I'm going to put it in this video. Give me just a second. Okay. Um, let me see here. I also forgot this stuff. I picked up a thing of onion soup mix. And then I got four cans of the cream of chicken, a can of cream of celery, a can of cranberry sauce. This is for a recipe. Um, a thing of barbecue sauce this is for the same recipe with the cranberry. And yeah, that's all in that bag. So that's it for the groceries. And then for the airplane, oh, for the trip, um, we're going to see some family that I haven't seen in probably about three or four years. Um, and so we needed just a couple of travel items because we'll only be gone for a week. So I picked up some of this lotion here. Some of these because I do my own eyebrows and I just need to shape them up. Two of these limited edition white twigs. A pack of wet ones antibacterial hand wipes these are good to have with you um, at the airport and you know on the plane just in your bag in general when you're traveling a travel toothbrush which came with toothpaste and I bought some separate so I have an extra little toothpaste in case we need it and I bought my daughter a travel toothbrush as well and this is just for my boyfriend at work um, so he has something to cover his mouth because there's a lot of dust and everything. Whew. Anyway, oh, my floor looks, yeah. Anyways, <laughs> um, thanks for watching my video and I hope you all enjoyed. Have a blessed holiday and talk to you all soon. Bye.